Smartphones are an indispensable tool for visually impaired people. Visually impaired users operate smartphones via a screen reader, for example, voice over or talkback, following a touch and listen model. Prior studies have demonstrated visually impaired users encounter the following issues when using a smartphone. First, getting the phone out of a pocket is inconvenient and time consuming. Second, using a smartphone is more difficult when only one hand is available. Third, the risk of unintentionally exposing personal data to bystanders is high. Finally, this posture may draw unwanted attention in public settings. In this paper, we present a ring based any surface gesture input system to enhance phone interaction. Our system uses a smart ring with a single inertial measurement unit to sense gesture inputs and delivers feedback to the user via earphones. Wearing the ring on the middle phalanx of the index finger, users can perform 15 gestures on any surface, for example, table, thigh, etc., to operate their phones. We conducted participatory studies to obtain a set of versatile commands and appropriate gestures. We trained an SVM model and achieved an average of 95.5% accuracy on 15 classifications. When using the ring-based input system, visually impaired users triple tap a surface using finger pulp to enter the ring operation mode and then complete tasks by performing gestures and receive auditory feedback via earphones. Here are example scenarios. Answer a phone call. Send a message to a friend. Listen to news. We evaluated the usability of this ring-based any surface gesture input system. Results show that it is easy, efficient, private, and fun to use. After listening to our oral explanation of commands and gestures for 15 minutes, participants acquired them in less than 10 minutes. When the phone was in the user's pocket, the ring interaction was more efficient than the baseline phone interaction on all three surfaces. Participants also expressed interest in using the ring-based interactions in their daily lives, 